Well, a Bay Area state lawmaker is making history this morning as the first black woman to lead a party in the Florida House. State Rep. Fentress Driscoll is the new House Democratic leader. Erin Parsegian joins us live with details on her historic election. Good morning, Erin. Good morning. Yeah, this has really been months in the making. Driscoll was first picked by her Democratic colleagues at a special session back in May. And then at a special ceremony last night in Tallahassee, she was officially sworn in as the House Minority Leader. Now, Driscoll, the Tampa attorney, was first elected back in 2018 and now will be the first black woman in state history to lead either party in the state house. She joins another barrier breaking Tampa Bay lawmaker, former state senator Arthenia Joyner, who was the first black woman elected to serve as the party leaders in the state Senate back in 2014. At the ceremony Monday, Driscoll spoke on the House floor surrounded by pictures of Joyner and thanked her for her guidance. I understand on whose shoulders I stand. I understand the history that I'm walking into at this moment. And for that reason, I must acknowledge Senator Arthenia Joyner. Every woman, and especially every black woman, serving in this legislature right now, owes a debt and an homage to her. Now, Driscoll's two-year leadership role will come at a difficult time for Democrats as Republicans post-midterm hold super majorities in each chamber. We also caught up with Driscoll back in May when she was first selected by her Democratic colleagues to fill this historic role. And we'll hear from her coming up in the next half hour. Live in Tampa, Aaron Parsegian, 10 Tampa Bay.